Hey, what up guys, to Nako here. Today we show you another fast way to get your hands on a ton of Phoenix credits and some level 31 high-end gear. Yeah, I'm not kidding, level 31 high-end gear. I hope you're gonna enjoy the video and let's go for it! You know guys, sometimes exploits and glitches in games are like physical signs to me. Like Einstein's theory of relativity or the set of Pythagoras. And I don't even know if I pronounced that right, set of Pythagoras. You know what I mean? Well, okay, maybe I'm going too far, but when I first heard of this forming method, I was like, holy shit, who came up with this? Are people out there like trying to find glitches all the day? Is there really someone sitting in front of his PC and doing nothing else than finding those glitches? It's not possible that anyone figured this out by accident. Or maybe someone did? I don't know, I guess I'm looking too deep into things. Well, sorry guys, I got carried away. Let's get back to the point and take a closer look on the new Hornet farming method. Hornet is the boss of the mission Russian Consulate. First of all, start the mission Russian Consulate on challenge difficulty and fight your way to the boss. As soon as you reach this point, you will get a checkpoint, so don't worry about dying. As soon as you reach the checkpoint, kill the first wave of ads and have your friends fast travel to either the firewall safe house or the mission general assembly. But have one person stay in the mission to trigger the boss spawn. Now wait till all your friends are at the gate located at the backside of the consulate. We show you the exact spot on the map. The players at the gate need to shoot a hole into the wall. I recommend to break the left handed wall when facing the gate. When the agents at the gate are ready, have the player that stayed inside the mission activate the defeat Hornet objective. The person who activates the boss spawn will backtrack until he is out of combat and then fast travel to where his friends are. Well, they should be at the gate by the time this happens. Now kill Hornet. It can be quite an annoying task, but if you trigger him right, he will just stay at one spot and you guys can shoot him through the hole easily. When Hornet is dead, have the person who triggered him die at the gate. He will respawn at the checkpoint and can trigger Hornet again. So all that already sounds like freaking math, guys. But now shit is getting real. How do you get your loot? Well, take cover at the sandbags and move around the corner. When the animation is almost over, hit the jump button to glitch through the gate. That's how you get in and out. I think when you look at the video, you know what I mean. Well, all that sounds fucking complicated, and it's probably the trickiest exploit the Division has seen so far. But it's actually not that hard. What do you guys think of the Hornet form? Please let us know in the comments below. Well, that's it for today, guys. Thanks a lot for watching, and as always, like if you like, dislike if you don't like the shit, and feel free to subscribe to our channel for more awesome The Division and Gaming stuff. See you next time.